this? What's happening? I just like to come home from work and find presents in your yard. I found one. Yes, that's half a truck. So, real quick, why is there half a truck in my yard? Well, I was down in the junkyard the other day at my buddy's place, and uh, I bought a, uh, bought a 96 F-150. We were sitting there bullshitting. Happened to look out in the back, and I seen this thing. Now, this was about as long as the whole thing. It had a utility body. So, it's got a five-speed in it. It's got a 73 IDIDs on it. The truck is obviously junk. But believe it or not, it has hundred, what we believe to be 109,000 miles. So I sent him a message. We're friends on Facebook. We talk, share jokes and bullshit. I said, hey, man, I said I'd buy the trans out of that, but how much are the motor and everything out of it? He says, never heard it run. I said, you care if I come down and throw a couple batteries and try to start? He said, I don't care. Do what you want. So I went down Saturday. Threw a couple batteries in it, and we could not get it to start. We fooled with it for about half an hour or so. Motor does turn over by hand. Glow plugs actually cycle. Everything comes on. Uh, it's full oil, full antifreeze. Believe it'll run, starter's locked up. We beat on it, no love. So I said, you know what? So what do you want for everything? I said, I, I want the radiator, you know, I want it all. I said, I'll I'll if the motor's bad, it's on me. You know, it is what it is. He says, I don't know. He says, uh, he says, why don't you just take the thing back to your place and you pull it? And I'm looking going, ain't going to fit on my rollback. And the wrecker, I still don't have tags on it yet. I said, why don't you just burn it off behind the cab? And he says, I can do that. So I got home this evening and this was in the yard. So he cut her off at the back of the cab. So tomorrow I'm going to order a starter and I'm going to throw a starter in it and uh, see if it'll run. Now, if it does run... This is more than likely going to find its way into, if you follow my YouTube, if you follow uh, my builds and, and craziness, uh, this is going to find its way into the 73, and I hate the term rat rod, but that's what I'm putting together, this old 70, actually it's a 75, I'm sorry, 75 F-350 Wrecker. The one that uh, is pretty crusty. I did one floor, still got to do this floor. Originally, I was going to put a uh, small block gas motor in it because I'm not really going to tell with it. It was kind of going to be just a toy. Um, eventually, down the road, once it's tagged and it's all the bugs were worked out of it, I planned on slamming this truck. Why I'm not going to do it from the get-go is because I want to tag it antique. And in my state, if it's all stock, you can antique it. So why not a 7.3 IDI with a 5-speed? in this then down the road maybe uh turbo twin turbo or some goofiness like that you know and again we'll see how it goes but for right now uh, i actually have a couple more seven threes out back so if that one doesn't run i do have some more seven threes uh but the ones out back they're just complete motors i don't have brackets and all so that's why i said i'll buy that it gives me a radio gives me all the brackets and everything off the front flywheel if it's not a dual mass flywheel um we'll see so yeah that's what uh, i came home today so look i'm gonna get at it um i got some work to do i really can't fool that this evening i've got some regular work to do uh and then hopefully i'll uh do a video of uh will it run in the next day or two i may not get a chance to do tomorrow because they're calling for rain uh, but I'll at least get the starter. I do have a junk rollback out back. There's a 7.3. I can't remember if the starter was in it. I'm getting ready to go out back now and look and see if the starter's in it. If it is, I do know that 7.3 out back in that rollback runs. It smokes, but it runs. Um, maybe it's got a good starter. I don't have to go spend a couple hundred bucks. So look, holler at your boy. Catch me in a day or two. See you.